And with the singing of the national anthem, we get ready to play baseball on an overcast evening here at the ballpark. Rain showers predicted. We had a couple this afternoon. Nothing major. Field's fine. We will start on time. The Vermont defense tonight. Brian Schaub at first base. Anthony Stephan at second. Jack Perkle at short. And Tyler Fabretto at third. The outfield, Darren Hagan in left. Andrew Bergeron in center. Jimmy Evans in right. The catcher, Matt Dupre. The pitcher out of CVU in Hinesburg and Endicott College, Ian Parent. Parent, a record of 1-2 and two on the year with a 4-15 ERA, making his sixth appearance, his second start. He's worked 17 and a third innings, allowed 10 hits, 11 runs, eight of those earned, nine walks, 17 strikeouts, opponents hitting 167 against Perrin. Vermont has had a wonderful month of July. They have gone 19 and two in the month of July. Ian Perrin has pitched in the two games they lost. He's pitched three times recently. On the 8th of July at Norwich, he was involved in a relief outing as pitched four and a third innings, gave up four hits and six runs, three of them earned. Then his next outing was a good one here at home on the 15th in the win over Pittsfield. He worked five innings, allowed just one hit, struck out five. But then his last outing on the 21st against Brockton, he was involved in a loss, suffering the defeat as he went two and two-thirds innings as a starter, allowed three hits, five earned runs, walked three, and struck out three. So Parent will be looking to bounce back tonight. And the Lake Monsters looking to hold on to or increase their half-game lead in the league standings. Brockton, the second-place team, playing at Norwich tonight. Alec Retch out of Middlebury College, the right fielder, standing in to lead off. Thank you for joining, everybody. And the first pitch from Parent is high and away, ball one. One ball, no strikes. Rich hitting 242, five doubles, two home runs. He's driven in 20. And he is a serious threat if he gets on the bases. He has stolen 26 out of 30. 1-1 one, one pitch, and it's on the inside corner for a strike and the count one and two. Alec Rich out of the state of California. And he foul tips it into the mid and strikes out, and that's how this one begins tonight. Rich strikes out, one away in the New Britain first inning. And the batter is Ryan Bagdasarian, the center fielder out of Eastern Connecticut State. Right-handed bat, and Parent starts him with a strike. Nothing in one. Bagdasarian hitting 314, 44 hits and 140 at bat. Six doubles, two triples, two homers. He's driven in 16. Pitch taken high. He is also dangerous on the base pads. He's stolen 16 out of 20. Pitch, swung on and missed in the count, one and two. In fact, overall, New Britain, 98 stolen bases as a team. They are third in the league in that department. Chopper to the right side, up to get it is Stefan, flips it on to Schaub, and that's the second out of the inning. Four to three. Two out, nobody on in the first inning for the visitors. And here is Davis Kopp off the campus at the University of Utah. Kopp hitting 284 with four doubles, a triple, 
two homers. He's driven in 17. Yeah, he's stealing bases, too. He's stolen seven out of eight. Two out, nobody on. Parent, the left-hander, with the pitch. Drops the breaking ball on the inside corner. A strike, nothing, and one. Ian Parent had an outstanding career at CVU. Now pitching for Endicott College in Massachusetts. Pitch low. And the count, one ball and one strike. Vermont pitchers have had a very solid year on this Lake Monster Club. Pitch low. I say Vermont pitchers. I'm talking about in-staters. Two balls, one strike. And a swing and a miss, two and two. Now Parent works. Breaking ball. Parent thought he had it. I sort of thought he had it, but Larry Rieger didn't. And now it's a full count, three and two, on the New Britain catcher. And he's on, takes it inside, ball four. So Davis Kopp draws the two-out base on balls. Man on with two down for Colin Kelly. Kelly, the New Britain shortstop out of Fairfield University, are on his way there. Hitting 226, 7 for 31 with a double, and one run batted in. The first pitch, ball one. One ball, no strikes. Overcast night, temperature mid to upper 60s. There's a fastball away for a strike, one and one. Forecast was for more rain than we have gotten so far. Hopefully that missed forecast will continue inaccurate for the next couple of hours. Breaking ball on the outside corner, a strike, and parent ahead now on Kelly. One ball, two strikes. Now the left-hander throws. Kelly bounces it on the right side, taken by Stefan. Slips as he throws, but got it on the money to Schaub. And the inning is over as Parent works around the two-out walk. Nothing across. A man left will go to the bottom of the first. No score. This is Lake Monster Baseball. Now the second inning at the ballpark. Vermont out to a one nothing lead. Zach Donahue, Todd Peterson, and Sammy Smith, the five, six, and seven hitters in the New Britain order to face Ian Parent. Donahue, the second baseman out of the University of Connecticut, takes a strike from Ian Parent, nothing and one. Donahue, a 200 hitter, six doubles, a triple, two homers, and he's driven in 10. Takes the pitch down and in. One ball and one strike. Donahue out of South Windsor, Connecticut. Sophomore at UConn. 1-1, one, one. swing and a miss, and the count one and two. As we said, the Lake Monsters playing game number 52. They'll have 14 remaining after tonight. Break that down for you as we go along. Pitch outside, and the count is 2-2. Two and two. One more with New Britain here tomorrow night. Then they go to New Britain for games on Saturday and Sunday. Ground ball foul. 
handled in the coaching box expertly and returned to Ian Parent. Actually, got to amend what I said. Vermont and New Britain are playing a split admission doubleheader. There is strike three called, breaking ball on the inside corner. And Donahue caught looking for the first out here in the second inning. Parent with his second strikeout. They will play New Britain here tomorrow night. Then on Saturday, they play a 12 noon game at New Britain, which will be telecast regionally on Nesson. That's at 12 noon on Saturday. Then they play Saturday night, a separate admission game at 6.30. They go to Worcester on Sunday to play a 4 o'clock afternoon game. One ball and one strike on Todd Peterson, the New Britain third baseman. Then Vermont has an off day. Then two games in Westfield, a game in Pittsfield, and a game in Nashua. So this is Vermont's longest road trip of the year. A seven-game trip starting on Saturday. Ball hit in the air, right side foul. And the count, two balls and one strike on Peterson. Vermont will then come home and play the final six games of the regular season here at Centennial. 2-1 pitch, down low, and it's 3-1 and one on the New Britain third baseman. So the bottom line, Vermont has 14 games remaining, seven at home, seven on the road. 3-2, and that's inside ball four. And the second walk issued by Parent, a one-out base on balls here in the second inning. One on, one out for Sammy Smith, the left fielder. Smith out of Middlebury College. Hitting at 250. He's only been in seven games. Six hits in 24 at bats. All six hits have been singles, and he's got four runs batted in. Sammy Smith, his dad, David Smith, Middlebury grad at class of 97, is the owner of the New Britain Bees franchise. Two balls and no strikes to count here on Smith. Peterson at first with one out, parent to the plate, a swing and a miss. 82 miles an hour up. And the count on Smith, two and one. The Smith family. Sammy out of Newtown, Connecticut. And the pitch, a ball and a steal of second base. Two balls and two strikes now on Smith. Peterson, the tying run into scoring position with New Britain's 99th stolen base of the year. Two two coming to Smith and he fights it off foul on the ground over toward the New Britain dugout. Two balls, two strikes on Smith. Peterson steal his seventh of the year. Now Parent with a 2-2 to Smith, and Smith fouls it away to the right. So we will do it again with a 2-2 count. Peterson out to a substantial lead. 
And Parent strikes out Smith on a pitch up. So that is the second out of the inning. It is the third strike out of the evening for Ian Parent. Two gone in the New Britain second inning, and here's Jimmy Sullivan, the first baseman, off the campus at UMass Lowell. Sullivan, a 131 hitter, two doubles, and 13 runs batted in. Sullivan, 13 hits in 99 at-bats. Lefty on lefty, parent to the plate, and down low, ball one. One ball, no strikes. Parent from the belt. Swing and a miss, in under the hands on the left-handed bat. One and one, the count on Sullivan. Number eight hitter in Don McKillop's New Britain batting order. Breaking ball for a strike. Nice looking curveball at 70 miles an hour. And Parent works ahead now, one and two on Sullivan. Trying to leave the tying run out at second. Parent to the belt. Here's the pitch. Breaking ball. Got him looking. Outside corner. And the inning is over. Four strikeouts in the first two innings for Ian Parent. No runs. A walk and a man left. Middle of the second. one nothing Vermont. This is Lake Monster Baseball. Third inning now here at Centennial Field in Burlington, Vermont, leading New Britain one to nothing. New Britain sends up their designated hitter, Lake Mich uh, Luke Mashuk, to lead off, and he swings late on an Ian Parent delivery, nothing and one. Mashuk off the campus at Northeastern. Hitting at 114, 5 for 44. One of his five hits a triple. He's got two runs batted in. One ball, one strike. He'll be followed by Alec Rich and Ryan Bagdasarian at the top of the New Britain order. A swing and a miss again. Mashuk late on the parent delivery. And the count, one ball, two strikes. The left-hander back. Mashuk takes, and it's down low. Two balls, two strikes. Mashuk, 6'1", 195, from Trumbull, Connecticut. And takes inside ball three. So, Parent had him one and two. Now he's run it full. Parent through the first two innings has walked a pair, struck out four. And there is number five on the outside corner down. Mashuk's not buying it. All I will say was it looked a little generous from Larry Rieger. One gone in the New Britain third inning. Back to the top of the order for Alec Rich, who struck out his first time. Late on the parent delivery again, nothing in one. Backdoor breaking ball is strike, and parent quickly ahead on Rich. No balls, two strikes. Ian working quickly. Strikes him out. Hard stuff down. Four consecutive strikeouts for Parent. Six total over two and two-thirds. Two out and nobody on. 
for Ryan Bagdasarian, the center fielder who grounded out to second his first time. Parent working quickly. Down in the dirt, ball one. One ball, no strikes. Ball on the ground through the left side of base hit. First hit of the night for New Britain. A two-out single here in the third inning for Bagdasarian. And it'll put a man on with two out for the catcher, Davis Kopp, who drew a walk his first time. Parent has had to deal with one base runner in each inning. A couple of walks in the first two, and now a two-out single here in the third. Left-hander from the belt goes over there, chasing Bagdasarian back to the bag again. New Britain likes to run. Bagdasarian has stolen 16 bases. They are looking for their 100th of the season right now. They've had one tonight. Again, Parent goes over there. Now the left-hander again to first, and this time he throws it away. Ball goes to the barrier, steaming around second. The runner on his way to third, and he will be there. So a two-base throwing error by Parent puts the tying run at third base now with two away. First error of the night for either side. The batter cop with the tying run at third base. And a swing and a miss on a breaking ball. Nothing in one. Cop out of the University of Utah. 17 RBIs for New Britain this summer. Seven extra base hits, including a couple of home runs. A one from Parent, and it's down low. One ball and one strike. Parent got the first two men, struck them both out here in the third, but then the signal by Bagdasarian, and again with Vermont very aware of New Britain's abilities to run. A lot of throws to first base, and one got away. Breaking ball dropped on the inside corner for a strike. So the count now one and two on the New Britain catcher. Parent trying to leave that tying run 90 feet away. He's ready to work. One and two, here it comes. And a little outside, maybe a little high. Matt Dupre wanted the call, didn't get it from Larry Regert. Two balls and two strikes now on comp. The set by Parent, here's the pitch, and it's down low. Blocked by Dupre, full count, three balls, two strikes. First base is open, Colin Kelly, the shortstop on deck. Three balls, two strikes, two out, third inning. Vermont up a run. Parent at the set, pitching, and a little roller foul up the third baseline. 
Count holding, three balls, two strikes on Comp. Now the New Britain catcher settles back in. Parent with the sign, he's ready. 3-2, here it comes. Swung on and missed, strike three. Got him with the breaking ball. And Parent strikes out the side, leaves the tying run at third. Nothing across for New Britain. Middle of the third, up nothing. It's Vermont up one nothing. This is Lake Monster Baseball. Three inning totals at the ballpark. Vermont a run on four hits, one error. The Monsters have left four. New Britain bees, no runs, one hit, no errors. They have left three. Colin Kelly, Zach Donahue, and Todd Peterson, the middle third of the New Britain batting order, facing left-hander Ian Parent here in the fourth. And the ball hit on a line, and just off the tip of the glove of Stefan, and on with a leadoff base hit is Kelly. Ball was hit sharply. I'm saying it's a base hit. They haven't put it up on the board yet. Stefan going to his right. Got glove on it. It is a hit. Lead off single for Kelly here in the fourth inning. Man on, nobody out. And the batter, Zach Donahue, grounds one through the right side and a base hit. Kelly turns first, goes to third, and just like that, first and third, nobody out for New Britain. So both first ball hitting, Kelly and Donahue have set the table very well here for New Britain. First and third, nobody out for Todd Peterson, who walked and stole a base in the second inning. Monsters play the infield back, double play depth. They'll give up the tying run to get two here with nobody out. Parent to the set. And the pitch and a swing and a miss. Each hitter has gone after the first pitch here from Parent in this fourth inning. Nothing and one the count on Peterson. Now Parent lobs the throw over. Donahue back to the bag. Donahue has 10 steals on the year. Ball hit on the ground, foul down the left side. And the count, no balls and two strikes on Peterson. New Britain with one steal tonight, 99 as a team. Now Parent, 0-2 to the plate, and a pop-up. That'll get out of play back to the right. So the count holding on Peterson, no balls, two strikes. Breaking ball, swung on and missed, strike three. Big out for Ian Parent, the first out of the inning. That's seven strikeouts for Ian Parent. First and third, one out for Sammy Smith, who struck out his first time. And Parent again throwing over, and Schaub had to come off the bag to... Saved that one from getting away. Parent overthrew a pickoff attempt last inning. 
Now the left-hander throws and misses. Must have been a little high, I guess. Ball one. One ball, no strikes on Smith out of Middlebury College. And let up delivery for a strike. One and one on Smith. Smith up there with the first baseman, Jimmy Sullivan, waiting on deck. 1-1. One, one. Foul back to the right. And it is one and two now on Smith. Kelly and Donnie, you both swinging at the first pitch. Led the inning with back-to-back -back singles. Parent trying to get the second out of the inning here. Again, kind of soft toss, lobs the ball over to first base, keeping Donahue close. Now Parent ready, pitching, and freezes Smith with a breaking ball and strikes him out. For the second out of the inning. So now it is two on and two out. And Jimmy Sullivan coming to the plate. Sullivan called out on strikes his first time. And it is a strike, nothing, and one. Parent with nine strikeouts. Pitches to Sullivan, who fouls it away to the left, so the count 0-2. Parent one strikeout in the first, got the side on strikes in the second, got the side on strikes in the third, and he's had two strikeouts here in the fourth, trying to work around the back-to-back -back leadoff singles. Pitch swung on and hit in the air out toward left center field, and coming on to make the grab is Darren Hagan, and the inning is over. Hagan had to cover some ground, but he tracked it down. And New Britain wastes the two leadoff hits. They leave two on base. We go to the bottom of the fourth. Vermont still leading 1-0. This is Lake Monster Baseball. <laughs> 